commit to doing the work. So yesterday we talked about, you know, setting goals, making some kind of plan. Obviously, once you've got a plan, you've got to commit to do the, do the work and follow the plan. Um, otherwise, the plan is a waste of time. So yeah, commit to doing the work, making it a habit. Not just for, you know, 30 days, not just for 12 weeks, 6 months. But make it a habit so that it becomes part of who you are. Sure, at first it might seem like effort, it might seem hard work. For example, if you've got, you know, if, you're, if you've got some weight to lose, it means you're going to have to put in some work. You might have to do some exercise, it might, you might have to make some changes to your diet. That all takes work, that all takes effort. But once that effort, that initial effort, once it becomes a habit, it just becomes part of who you are and it's subconsciously programmed into your brain that you don't have to actually think about what you're doing. It's just a habit. It just happens, right? Just like, you know, when you get up and you tie your shoelaces in the morning, uh, it's a habit. When, you know, I remember when I was a kid and I was learning to tie my shoelaces, it took a lot of work. It took a lot of effort. My mum had to show me how to do it a few times. But I've repeated it enough consistently over time that it now is a habit and I don't have to think about how to tie my shoelaces. It's the same within your business. The first day you started a new job uh, or you started a new business, it took some work at first to get things off the ground and, and to get into your routine. Now it's just part of who you are. You just get up and get on with it. So at first you need to put in the work, put in the effort. So set yourself a goal. Have a plan and commit to doing the work. Take care.